Hello. Thanks for joining us for a weekly devotional, and I hope it's encouraging to you. An angry motorist returned to the garage where he bought a very expensive battery just six months earlier. And he went up to the mechanic and he said, listen, when I bought this battery, you told me it would last the lifetime of my car to be the last battery I'd ever need. And it died only after six months. The mechanic looked at him apologetically and said, sorry, sir. I honestly didn't think your car would last that long. We pay a premium price for things. We expect them to last. We don't want our battery to ever wear out. We don't want our car to ever wear out. We don't want our appliances to quit working, but we know they're going to because that's the way things work. They wear out, they get old, and they quit working. But even though we don't want them to, we still have to live with the fact that they will. We know that they're not going to last, and we're going to have to replace them, but it's still not very exciting when we have to do it, and we're still not very happy about it. But it's even true that we don't want our bodies to wear out. But each and every day, we're reminded that we're getting older. Each and every day, we're reminded that our bodies are going to wear out. Peter said in 1 Peter chapter 1, in verses 24 and 25, For all men are like grass, and all their glory is like the flowers of the field. The grass withers and the flowers fall. But the word of the Lord stands forever. And this is the word that was preached to you. We live in a world that's composed of that which is temporary. Everything that's around us, it's, it's material, that's physical. It's not going to last. It's only temporary. All will eventually fade. All will eventually die. All will eventually wear out. The only thing which will last is that which has its foundation in God and his word. That's all that's going to live on. The only thing we take with us from this world is our relationship with God. And that's all that will live on. So let us live our lives so that we can be grounded in that which will never be destroyed, the word of God. So that we can focus on that and walk in the light of our Lord each day so that we know we'll live in eternity with him. Let us pray. Father, we thank you so much for your love and your blessings, and we thank you for granting us the opportunity to walk with you and walk in your word. We thank you for providing your word and guidance that, that we can read and we can get closer to you and understand your love for us and, and share that love with those around us. Father, as we come to you, you know we desire that eternal life. We desire to have that that blessing that comes from knowing you and from living in your light. Father, we just pray, dear Lord, we understand that all that's physical, all that's material is not going to last. It's going to wither away. It's going to die. But we, as long as we walk in your word, our soul will live on with you forever. Our spirit will be happy in you and will be blessed with the opportunity to just spend eternity with you in heaven. Thank you, Father, for giving us that opportunity, and we just pray, dear Lord, that, that we take advantage of it and that we prepare for that day as we walk in your ways as we go through this physical world, knowing that our spirit will live on and we can prepare for that day. And it's through Jesus we pray. Amen. Thank you for joining us, and I hope you have a great week.